All right, well, let's take a look at the tropics here. We are beginning our season now here. The kind of the heart of the season. I like to call it from August 15th all the way to October 15th. Those two month period is when the most of the active uh, storms we get here across the uh, Gulf of Mexico and the Gulf South. And we're watching two systems out there now. Invest 97 and will eventually be Invest 98 out here behind it. Uh, both expected to kind of move off to the west and west northwest. Uh, I think 90 what would be 98 kind of moves just off to the north here, but uh, watching 97 potentially getting into the Caribbean and maybe strengthening as it gets farther into the Caribbean as well, too. So we need to keep an eye on that one. I have a possibility of maybe becoming a threat to the Gulf of Mexico, and you'll see here in a second what I'm talking about. Right now, though, it's still way here off to the uh, east of the Windward and Leeward Islands. Uh, winds are at 30, moving quickly west of 23, and expected to continue that fast pace for a while. Once it gets north of Curacao, it may start to slow down in the central part of the Caribbean. That's when it could have a chance to develop, but not until the middle part of the week. That's why the chance goes up to 50% in about five days. That track does take it there and you can see here it kind of curves its way here onto the eastern part of the Gulf of Mexico in the next say seven to ten days, possibly impacting Florida. Now for, again, you have to remember this is not developed yet. It has to develop first, has to survive the trek through here, the Caribbean as well too. So that's definitely something we'll be watching closely as we get forward here into the next couple of days. But just to keep that in mind is that time of year we could see some systems. And by the way, these systems will get the names Laura as well as Marco would be the next two systems. So we'll keep an eye on both of those moving on forward.